In this video, I'll be testing a pepperboard on a Coco 3 for a customer. Uh, the way that I test a pepperboard is I plug it in in place of the salt chip and make sure the Coco turns on. When the Coco is on, what I'll do is I'll load uh, drive wire. I'm sorry, I'll load HDB DOS via C load, C load M command to test the zero crossing detector. And then I'll run drive wire uh, to make sure that the serial port works. So here is a pepper board, one of the pepper boards, and I already have one installed in the Coco. And there it is. So first thing I'm gonna do is turn on the Coco. The Coco turns on. Next, what I'll do is I'll load uh, drive wire. Not drive wire, sorry, uh, HTB DOS. I'll do that via the C load, oops, C load and command. Now, <clears throat> I'm running drive wire on a Raspberry Pi and I will play the wave file from a Raspberry Pi. Here's my Raspberry Pi, okay, and it has, and I'm using a 3.5 millimeter audio jack to load HDB DOS. And so what I'll do is I'll come over here, because so I've already done this. Okay, and maybe you can see that. I'll use the A play command to load HTBDW3 CC3. Okay, and we should see this come up here. Now, while that is loading, let's load up drive wire. Okay, and so I've already done this before. So, drive wire should load right up. And there it is. This is drive wire for Java. And let's go here and we'll go to software websites, Curtis Boyle game sites. Okay, and let's show this. Let's load RoboAttack. Or RoboAttack. Okay. The bin file, there it is, it's loading. Okay, it's in memory, slot zero. This is finished loading. Let's do an exec. HDB DOS is ready to go. So I can just do a DIR and it will show up, <clears throat> which means the serial port is working. And now let's do load them. RoboTac. What did I, oh, I spelled it wrong because I'm doing this in a screen. Okay, as you can see, it's loading, it's going crazy. Now let's execute, and there it is. So the pepperboard works, drive wire works on a Raspberry Pi.